It's a miracle Autumn isn't worse off. That little girl is stronger than I ever could imagine. A five year old with quite the fight in her, surprising everyone after what she survived. I was going to say, Are you okay? But the words that came out, Where are you alive? Trent saw it first. A truck across the street, something stuck underneath it. And at first, I thought somebody had thrown a garbage bag or something in the road and she, the person had hit it. And then I was like, Is that a bike under there? He says the truck drove forward, then stopped and backed up. That's when Trent realized it wasn't just a bike. I saw the kid fall out and she was just limp. At first, I was terrified that I'd come across a dead child and it wasn't something I wanted to live with. Trent and his wife called 911. Others jumped in to help. Autumn ended up in Primary Children's Hospital with a softball sized hole in her shoulder down to the muscle. Tissue damage on her arm, burns on her back, shoulder and collarbone, her face severely scraped up. Did not think at all that she was as injured as she is. Um, it's definitely taken a toll on her, on our whole family. Dealing with what happened to their sweet little girl who had been riding back from school lunch where she wanted chocolate milk just down the street from home. Mom Kimberly says the driver didn't see Autumn trying to cross the street as the driver turned. She got pinned under the truck and was dragged 120 feet. Kimberly reached out to that woman to say that we loved her. We were sorry. We understood. We forgave her. Um, she's part of this trauma, too. As the family offers compassion, the community is offering them support through donations and asking to replace Autumn's bike, rallying together as Autumn amazes everyone with her recovery. She's tenacious and smart and strong and I know that she'll pull through like she just will. In Roy Lauren Steinbrecher, Fox 13 News, Utah.